Hi, Craig here from Craig Rogers Photography. So, maybe you've been using Adobe Lightroom Classic for a short amount of time, but you can't quite get to grips with the features that it provides. Or maybe you've never even seen the software, but you're thinking of investing in it to get into the world of post-processing. Well, my introduction to Lightroom Classic is a great way to familiarize yourself with the interface, but of course, also get to grips with the real powerful tools that sit behind it. Now, during the one-to-one -one Zoom call, I will give you a brief overview of the software, explain why it's different to Photoshop, I'll explain why it's not cheating, as some may suggest, and I'll also talk briefly about the catalogue system, which gives you a non-destructive workflow. What that means is it never modifies the original photograph. I will explain the difference between RAW and JPEG, and if your camera supports RAW, why it's far better to be shooting in RAW if you're going to post-process, and vice versa if you're not. I'll show you some quick photographs. We'll have a look at a photograph that's come directly out of a camera versus the same photograph that's been post-processed in Lightroom. And you'll really see the difference and how powerful the tool can be. Jumping into the actual software, we'll look at the interface and we'll go into the library module first. The library module is where you import photos, you rate photos, you can reject photos, you can color code photos, you can put keywords on photos so that you can organize them and search them easier and you can actually add photos into different collections and we'll look at all that but the main part of the call is about the heart of the system which is the develop module. It's where the magic happens, it's all the magic sliders that you can reduce and increase and you can change the light, you can change the colour, the noise reduction, the quality of the photo, the sharpness of it and you can also use tools to only process certain parts of the image. And we'll look at all that and you'll get to grips with how you use those tools and, and what differences all the sliders make. And then when you're happy with that I'll explain the best way to export the photos so you can share them with the whole world. So the, the online call I normally say to allow between two and three hours. It can be more, it can be less. It depends what you want to get out of it. I'm in certainly in no rush and I really want you to get to grips with that software. So it's a very relaxed atmosphere and we can take as long or as little as you wish. Now let's talk about Zoom, which is the online conferencing system that many people use. Um, it's available on any smart device, a PC and a Mac. What I would say about smart devices though, is I wouldn't recommend um, using a smartphone for this. I know these days the screens are getting quite large but because I'm trying to immerse you into the actual software I wouldn't recommend the, the, the screen. I will be zooming on certain parts of the, the screen which is fine but maybe a smartphone's not quite a big enough screen. Tablet, yeah that's probably okay or obviously a, a, a laptop or a computer screen is, is much much better. Um, you don't have to have a webcam. It doesn't matter if I see you or not. It does help me if I do see you, but it doesn't matter if you don't have a webcam. As long as you've got a microphone for the audio so that we can at least talk to each other, a webcam's not so important. Um, if you do have a copy of Lightroom Classic, feel free to have it open and sort of follow me as I tour around the copy that I have open. The only downside to that is you're either going to have to have it on a separate device or maybe have a dual screen setup like I've got, or perhaps a large screen that you can split it so you can see both on the same screen. But if it is something that interests you, I'd be love to see you on a, on a Zoom call, and I'd love to give you a tour around uh, Lightroom Classic. So get on over to the website, contact me, book your slot, and I'll see you on the call. Bye for now.